There are some sounds out there that when you hear them, you're transported to another place. You don't have to know where they're from or need to have heard them before. You just know now you're in the jungle or at a temple or among nature. Southeast Asia has some of the most rich and diverse culture on our planet, but somehow it's all tied together by music. The countries in this region all share a musical ancestry. Much like the Mekong River ties them together, so do their instruments. A great deal of the woodwind, percussion, or the various mallet instruments that come from Thailand, Cambodia, and Pratet Lao are practically the same, and this shared ancestry can be traced back centuries. Thai gong circles originated in the 13th century, and the Vietnamese dan da, a lithophone, counts as one of the oldest instruments in the world, dating back over 2,000 years. Sangara is made up of over 70 instruments from these beautiful places. As we travel down the river and out from the Mekong Delta, we make our way towards Indonesia, an archipelago of over 17,000 islands, over 700 languages, but with a strong musical thread stringing them all together. Indonesia is, of course, best known for its gamelan orchestras, but the gamelan is often accompanied by percussion and by woodwind instruments. And so Sangara features some of the bamboo flutes of the region, like the Suling and the Salawang, which we've sampled from Bali, Java and Sumatra. We can stay within Indonesia for a moment to look at another family of instruments in Sangara, stringed instruments. Indonesia's music predates any historical records, so it's hard to know where some instruments originated. Take the kachapi, for instance, an Indonesian zither, always a mother and child, the kachapi indung and kachapi anak. But this instrument is similar to the other so-called boat lutes of Southeast Asia, like the Vietnamese dan tran. And this shared history brings us to the mainland again. There's a hammered dulcimer, the Thai Kim, which is also found in Cambodia and Pratet Lao, and another ancient instrument, the Burmi Sangok, meaning arched harp. And last but not least, we come to the drums. We have 35 different drum and percussion instruments in the library from the unique tuned Thai drum circle, the Peng Mangkok, to Vietnamese bird wood blocks, Balinese cheng cheng, Siamese cymbals, and we go deep into the jungle to the bamboo slit drums used for communication, the Indonesian kentongan. The beauty of all these instruments is that they carry with them meaning and feeling that doesn't need describing, it simply needs to be heard. Sangara is an authentic and cinematic collection that allows you to weave fabric from Southeast Asia into your compositions. We're thrilled to present this rich regional heritage to you, and we hope you enjoy the library. <laughs>